Behold! Happy Freaky Fossil Friday. Time to meet the gothiest fossil. Black Skull. Forget Bella Lugosi. Black Skull's been dead 2.5 million years. This stunning skull was discovered in 1985 by Richard Leakey and Alan Walker. You guys really hit the jackpot. It was discovered on the shores of West Lake Turkana in Kenya. They determined it belonged to the species Pranthropus ethiopicus. And it's called Black Skull because of the amount of manganese. I like saying it like that. Manganese! By the way, this is a 3D print. And it's that manganese that gives Black Skull its gothy glow. The genus Paranthropus also included Paranthropus robustus and Paranthropus boisei. Black Skull is super prognathic, meaning its face juts out. Its cranial capacity is about 410 cc's. Similar to a modern day chimpanzee, Black Skull also has these beautiful flaring zygomatics. Or big ass cheekbones. You could have been a model. And this rather intense sagittal crest. Unfortunately, many of the teeth in Black Skull fell out. But we do know that Paranthropus ethiopicus skulls had PC megadontra, otherwise known as post canine big ass teeth. Essentially, these robust babarinos were chewing hard to grind food like grasses and sedges. Aside from the PC megadontra, they had big chewing muscles that went up through these flaring zygomatics and attached to this sagittal crest. Hey, better to eat the heart out. Am I right? Now that's a goth I'd like to see up a tree. So what happened to these hyper-robust hominin hotties? Well, it's thought that this genus is sort of a dead end in the lineage of human evolution. I'd like to think Black Skull lives on and is undead in my heart. Undead. Be sure to follow and send me your dead and undead requests. I love you. Hey, that's the molar of the story. <laughs>